Let's write the name for BaI2. So the first thing we're going to do, Ba, that's a metal, and then I, iodine, that's a nonmetal. So a metal and a nonmetal, we're going to treat this as an ionic compound. So first we write the name for Ba as it appears on the periodic table. That's barium. Next we'll write the name for I, that's iodine, lowercase i. And then we're going to cross out the I-N-E, and we're going to change that to I-D-E. So that makes the name for BaI2 barium iodide. If you were given the name barium iodide and asked to write the formula, you know that barium is in group 2 on the periodic table. It's 2 plus iodine. That's always 1 minus. So we need two of these 1 minus charges to balance out the barium. That's why we have BaI2 as the formula for barium iodide. This is Dr. B with the name for BaI2. It's barium iodide. Thanks for watching.